It's a pep rally. It's a medieval castle. It might be the beginning of a transportation revolution. It's the grand opening of Elon Musk's first tunnel. I'm Washington Post tech columnist Jeff Fowler, and I'm in Hawthorne, California, near Los Angeles, for a ride in a test tunnel from Boring, the tunneling company owned by Elon Musk. Why is Elon Musk making tunnels? It's not like he hasn't been busy sending rockets into space, trying to produce the Tesla Model 3, and battling regulators. Well, in 2016, Musk founded the Boring Company to explore digging tunnels as the answer to soul-destroying urban traffic. Some thought it was a joke, but $40 million and two years later, Boring is ready for an over-the-top launch party and to let us go inside. This test tunnel runs about 40 feet underneath a mile of road alongside the headquarters of SpaceX, another Musk venture. At about 12 feet in diameter, the tunnel is just wide enough to fit in a single car, which makes its way down to the tunnel through an elevator. Batman would be jealous. The car that goes through the tunnel is a modified Tesla Model X. It's got these bumpers added to the front that keep it aligned along the walls of the tunnel. Boring wouldn't let me film inside, but provided this footage of its own. Once a light at the front of the tunnel turned green, the car was off. How does it feel in there? A lot more like riding a roller coaster than I had expected. The experience was turbulent. The car jostled with many bumps in the concrete along the bottom of the tunnel, even though our top speed reached just 49 miles per hour. I do warn you, it's gonna be a, a slightly bumpy ride. It's a little rough around the edges. Once they smooth out some of the bumps, Musk said cars could go through the tunnel at up to 150 miles per hour. At his launch party, Musk said the Boring Company is doing lots of things to make tunneling faster and more cost-effective. For one, it's selling bricks made out of the dirt it digs up, which Boring demonstrated by building this medieval castle. I knew there was a reason it was here. Like other Musk endeavors, Boring is buzzy, but requires a leap of faith. For one, Musk's transportation plan depends on electric autonomous cars going mainstream fast. Then, Boring needs buy-in from finicky cities and communities. Last month, Boring withdrew another project under LA after community groups sued the government. It has plans for another tunnel in LA, as well as ones in Chicago and the DC to New York corridor. Is this the future of transportation? The Boring Company went from an Elon Musk tweet to all of this in just two years. But it's going to take a lot longer than that before it tunnels its way into your neighborhood.